little new product here. Got some Don Ross 21, 22 NBA. So we got um, orange laser and potentially purple laser parallels. Uh, the last <clears throat> Don Ross we did was soccer. And it, we hit pretty well on that. Um, you know, not the biggest and best of all that stuff, but I mean, got some good hits out of it. Get 88 cards, so you get a, a large number of cards. You know, we're looking for iconic rated rookies featuring the youngest stars. You get eight cards per pack, 11 packs. Let's see what else. Uh, we look for signature series autographs. You know, that's something. Hadn't seen an autograph in a while. Be really nice to get an autograph. Again, we have your odds. We'll open this box up. Uh, or at least take the packaging off of it. See if we can see the odds a little better. Let's see. What we got? Uh, looking for these. To just, not really odds, but just kind of show them what we can get in there. Complete player hollows. Number 15. A lot of number to 15 things. That's nice. A lot small number um, products. All right, let's get into it. Let's see what we got. Don Russ is <clears throat> probably the middle of the pack type product, I would say. Um, not the top high end. Mm. What are we gonna do? Oh, we take, let's take this one off. Let's take the mosaic. We'll put him right there. There we go. Add a little more to it. Yeah, there we go. All right, so <clears throat> not like I said, not the highest high end, but not the lowest end. Uh, good cards if you want to see kind of more just a player and everything, not something really like outrageous and crazy, but a good look of the card and the player. I, I like that. It's clean, neat uh, looking cards. Okay. Anthony Towns, Paul George, Kobe White. <clears throat> Uh, Definitely not saying that guy. Kelly O'Brien Jr., I think. And, okay, this is something I hadn't seen before. Magicians, Kevin Durant. It's a cool little insert. Nice little insert there. Hadn't seen anything like that before. Uh, of course, again, you're looking for the rated rookies. I uh, love to get rated rookies that are the orange prisms. I like to try to get or uh, rated rookies of um, purple. That would look really, really good. Lonzo Ball. Okay. Pascal. We got Kevin Porter Jr. Lorraine. Dinkin Robinson. Oh, there you go. Rated rookie. Bones, that's a nice name, cool name there. Bones Highland, rated rookie for Denver. Don't know much about him, probably was like a second rounder. We have our orange behind it, first orange. John Collins, so we'll put that one there. Let's see, Summer League coach, yeah. Don't know much about him. I have actually zero about him. But, I mean, Raider Rookie. You want the Raider Rookies, that's for sure. Quigley, Harden, White, Bay, Flynn, hey, Lamello. Second year Lamello. Let's see what we got here. Bagley, the third, in our orange is Robert Covington. Gonna get a lot of cards out of these. Um, gonna get some inserts. Trying to think about what all we got out of uh, the soccer. Uh, Young, Maxley, Sexton. Got the big names, second year, third year. Roser. Ah, there we go. That's a good one. That's one you want. I mean, it's base. Uh, it's a bigger, bigger name, Mobley. Um, you know, top five pick. Definitely want to get a lot of his. Again, neat card, um, showcasing the player. I like the rated rookie. I mean, that's kind of like first Bowman to a point. Probably not as, 
I mean, not as desired as, say, a first Bowman, but still up there. I think for basketball and football, you know, the rated rookies, you know, optic rated rookies, of course, are going to be the higher ones, but um, that's, a, that's a nice one. You know, that's similar to a um, first Bowman. Damian Lillard, complete players. Again, I don't know if this is new inserts or what, but I haven't really ever seen these before. And, I mean, hadn't done much done, Ross. It's nice, to actually. I mean, got this from Target <clears throat> online. It's nice to get some of these cards. Uh, Horford. Let's see what we got. Ooh. Ja. He's tearing it up. Randall. Julius Randall there. Keebler. Holiday. Kuzman. Ooh, now we got a rated rookie. Ah. Thought it was going to be the... You know, one of the top guys, but rated rookie orange. David Johnson. Don't know much about him. Second round. It's funny, it says you can find a superstar, you know, in the second round. But, you know, is he going to be a superstar? He's probably on a team that could help, you know, launch a career. Raptors kind of rebuilding. Or at least I think they are, <laughs> from what I can remember. Not the biggest in an NBA fan. Alexander, the wrong Curry, <laughs> Gordon, Ababalo, Bam, oh, Bayo, I think. Harris, Bridges, got another Raider rookie, Brandon Boston Jr. for the Clippers. I kind of remember him uh, from Kentucky. Yeah, Kentucky. Everybody, I think, coming out of high school and stuff, top five prospect, a little more than that maybe, kind of fell off. And then we got Camden Payne for the Suns. Those are orange. But yeah, Boston kind of fell off. Didn't get a high draft pick, I think, as he thought he probably should get. All right. Mills, Bryant, O'Neal. Everett, Gilbert, Finley, Finley Smith, Coro. Kind of wonder about him. He's someone I'm still kind of keeping my eye on. I may try, if I start getting through some card shows, which I hope to do here pretty soon, I'm going to look for some of his cards, uh, anything, especially auto that I can see, anything that um, comes about, you know, kind of pops and everything that might be a little, you know, Cheap, but stuff to be able to grab. I don't know why I'm really looking towards him. And Devontae Graham, don't know. But, yeah, Coro. He's someone I'm, I'm really thinking about, you know, collecting. <clears throat> someone who may, you know, like I said, if you can find some cheap deals. Um, starting, I mean, I know they've had card shows. They have them every month all across the country. But I think you're starting to have more into, you know, spring, summertime. You're going to see a lot more people probably get out to card shows. Um, it be interesting what all people are looking for. I'd like to be able to get to one here soon. Um, be able to kind of see, you know, what all people are selling, what all people are collecting. Ooh, Red Rookie. Devin Mitchell. That's a nice one. I think he... Is he Baylor? I want to say he was Baylor. Great expectations, Trey Man. That's not that's not a rookie, but um, that that's a good way to kind of see if you're not buying wax, you know, if you're not buying the uh, packs and open them and try to get players. Um, that's kind of cool. Chromebook right there. That's a product I use. That's a nice <laughs> product placement placement thing right there. But, uh, you know, what I was going to say is, you know, you're getting out there, you're trying to see what's all going on. It gives you an idea. If, you, if you're trying to just buy a player, you know, kind of, you kind of see what all the hobby is looking for. I mean, prices on like eBay, online, they give you an idea, but they're not the greatest, ooh, franchise features. That's kind of really cool. Um, no, it's going to be the greatest um, barometer of what's going on. You you want to go out there, 
go to a couple card shows, kind of see what's going on. Maybe get a good deal or two. You know, go in. If you go to a card show, definitely go in um, with a plan. Have a plan. You know, have a plan first of how much you want to spend. Two, what are you looking for? Are you looking to buy graded? Are you looking to buy raw? Uh, a mixture? Do you want rookies? Do you want established players? Things like that. Marcus Smith. The OG. Ooh. All right. Love that. I'll get to see what that is. Zion. Ooh, nice little Zion. I wonder if he's ever going to play. <laughs> I know I hadn't uh, sleeved any other cards, but Moses Moody, one of my guys. You know, I'm definitely looking towards him and stuff. Want to see how well he does this year. You know, he's, had, he's been up and down. But former Razorback, I always want my former Razorbacks. Put that right there. Big on my former Razorbacks and everything. Gotta, gotta support those guys. Right, let's see, last pack. Maybe we get some, now we got Moses Moody. Maybe we get a really awesome pack here. Burks, uh, Dylan Brooks, Kevin Durant. Eric Bledsoe, Colin Ingles, Fox, and Darius ba Basley. Basley, sorry, Basley. He was another one I've kind of looked at. Um, let's see, I think he was, he was a rookie last year. So this is year two. Year three for basketball is where you look at a lot of players um, moving forward, where they're at, what you think they can do. That's why I like a Cora, um, ba uh, Basil there. Those are players that I'm definitely going to be looking at because I, I'm, you know, I think they're they're going to some are going to pop, some are not going to pop. Um, sometimes you got to hedge your bets. If you think, hey, these five people are really going to be good, but this one person may be okay. You know, maybe you don't buy, maybe you don't buy, but maybe. Three or four cards of these. You know, maybe you get a lot of Akora. Again, it's all going to be about deals. Right? Don't go out and buy a ton of stuff of one player. You're like, oh, he's going to hit, he's going to hit. But don't do not do that. Don't do that. Um, unless you just have unlimited funds. Now, what you want to do is try to, you know, set a budget, set a plan. Sit there and be like, okay. If I get the card, these cards, you know, certain cards at this level, I'm going to buy. Uh, if I can get them at this level, I might buy. If they're at this level, I'm staying away from them and everything. And understand that, you know, what does it mean to have a hit? You know, let's just say Moses Moody. Um, rookie, you know, 14 picks. So he's not being viewed as an instant superstar. You could probably get some of his cards decent. But since he's a rookie, they're not going to be just, you know, dirt cheap. I mean, yeah, I mean this one right here is going to be, you know, 99 cents, dollar, stuff like that. No auto, nothing real special about it, not numbered. So, you know, if you're looking at him, you may be like, all right, in three, two or three years, I think he's really going to be big. So you'll set a plan and be like, okay. If I can find raw of his with autos that are under a certain amount of money. Now, where I'm at, he's going to be harder to get because people, you know, they're, they're fans of his. Uh, if you're in other parts of the country, you might be like, oh, well, yeah, I can get his cars because, you know, he's not being viewed as strong. You know, out in California, probably not as easy to get. New York, Florida, you know, places like that, you probably could get his cars a little easier. So if you're at a show there and you see his card and you're like, okay, if I can get autos under $100 of certain brands or say number cards under 50 of certain brands, I'm going to go for it raw. Uh, if I sit there and say, all right, I'm going to go for graded cards, what company are they graded? Um, I like HGA to begin with. I'm going to stay away from HGA. Uh, they have done me dirty. They're still doing me dirty. I'm staying away from them. I'm not sure how much longer they're going to stay around. 
I noticed Beckett chose to have a thirty dollar car uh, um, listing now that you can send cars in, but they're also saying it's six to nine months. Probably spent the nine months to get your cards back. Um, so that's going to hurt their value a little. PSA is kind of the same way. Saw some people talking about it online. They've had cards over a year, almost a year and a half, and they're still not even close to being done. Probably want to stay from, uh, you know, if it's a cheaper card, probably want to stay away from it. Now, if it's already graded PSA, probably going to be pretty high to buy to begin with, but it could be something that if you got a rated rookie numbered PSA 10 of Moses Moody and you set the price and say like, uh, you know, maybe 100, 150, probably less. Maybe you can get a less than that. You might want to jump on it. If it's an auto and it's going cheap, you might want to jump on that. Oop, then go through all these cards. Um, but you just, you know, set your budget. Set your idea of what you want. You know, if you think his cards are going to double, then if you get it for $100 and you're pretty sure it could go for 200 down the line, then, you know, that's a good deal. If you think you get a car for 100 and it's only going to increase to maybe 150 you know, might not be the greatest deal to go for. So you like him? I think the Cavs are going to jump up with Mobley and some of the other stuff they have. I think they're, you know, they're doing fairly well this year. I think his cars could go pretty high. And I haven't really checked because I'm not in basketball, like I said. His cars could be pretty high already. And let's see, who's our, ooh, Levine. That's nice to have. I do like Don Ross, again, because it seems like they're, I mean, this one's definitely off-center from here to here, but they're fairly good at uh, being centered. Um, they're not as glossy, so you're not getting as much um, surface problems with a lot as you will with some cards. Devontae Graham, Robert Covington, Brooks Lopez. So you another Cav. I like his cards are probably pretty high right now. Oh, Raider Rookie. Ooh, there you go. That's a nice one to have. He's been killing it for the Bulls. And Expectation, Chris Durant. Again, it, 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 this is like the stock market. It really is. You know, you make your spec, spec uh, speculation. Hey, this card is going to go this high. This person's going to blow up. Sometimes you win. Sometimes you lose. Lowry, Wall, Middleton, Murray. Oh, Raider rookie, Aaron Wiggins. Don't know much about him. Don't see when he was drafted. I wish that's the only thing I wish they would say in these. What round was these guys drafted? That kind of helps. That's what I like about baseball and stuff. But they actually put the. You know, where they, what round were they in? Were they sign, a signee out of, you know, international signee? Williams. Oh, Primo. All right, here we go. Another rated rookie. Uh, laser, uh, orange laser. Nice one to have. Pretty sure he was definitely a first rounder. Pretty, pretty good centering on it. Not bad. Don Ross, the, it's printed so many, they print so many of these things that honestly, you're probably going to need to, you know, you're probably going to need to curve your expectations on some of this. Inserts in certain things, you might be able to get a decent amount, even, you know, for any rookie. Inserts of these are going to be so many of them. That you you almost have to get numbered to be, you know, to be worth it. Let's see. There's Durant, Malcolm, Bergen. Um, it's kind of like tops. You know, you get a lot of hoops. There's so many of those printed. The print runs are outrageous. Uh, you don't even really know the print runs on a lot of that. So not having numbered or something really special. You know, it's kind of hard. Colum, Ingles again, Fox, Tim Hardaway Jr., and Harrison Barnes. So, I mean, cool cards. Uh, like I said, not going to be outrageous in what you get. Uh, 
You want the you want the purple. Anything numbered, it's gonna be good to get Towns, George, Hampton. Oh, Daniel Gaffer. There we go. Former Rays bet. Springer. Nice Raider rookie. And Murray. Franchise features. Cool. Nice little insert there. Not as flashy as some of the other ones, but still pretty cool. Ball, Ron Ball. I don't know. I guess I won't say Ron Ball. He's doing pretty good. Well, I thought he was. He may not be anymore. Love, Clarkson, and Ari. Uh, Kier, uh, Ari. Uh, uh, I can't say the name. I'm moving on. <laughs> Tired right now, man. Crazy dude. Let's just go with Crazy dude. <laughs> Quigley, Harden, White. Arden, Kisaba, Hayward. Ooh, Cam Thomas. There we go. Nice one. And Cole Anthony. That's my one of the guys I kind of keep want to keep up with. I think he may be no one of my sleeper picks. Thaddeus Young, Matsy, Wendell Carter Jr., Powell. That there's Anthony again. And Jimmy Butler. All right, last pack. Let's see what we got. Maybe we got some really cool stuff here. Let's see. Let's see. About to get an insert. Probably won't. Or, well, not an insert, but... Number card. John Morant, Wiseman, Davis, Bollock, Raider Rookie, huh? Keon Johnson, and Corey Kespit. Okay. So, nothing spectacular. Uh, I mean, if you want to build sets and stuff, if you want to build up a... Really cool collection of cards. Don Ross is your brand, for sure. Uh, if you want some milder inserts than what you might see in places, Don Ross is your, is your set of cards. Um, if you want like some really just, you know, kind of, I mean, I won't say bland, but just kind of different looking cards... Um, well, maybe not differently, but kind of, uh, let's see what I'm trying to say here. I guess if you're just trying to see like an, an average set, you know, an average set of cards, some, but something that could have something really, really cool. Um, you get kind of your first Bowman's almost with, um, the Raider rookies. You kind of get your Bowman chromes with these like orange ones. Um, I mean, that's just, that's a decent set. You get to see them, you know, these rookies with their uniforms, and it's not um, just the team with college logos or anything on that. Uh, so, I mean, good set. There's a ton of it, so you're gonna you're gonna have to either be cautious and buy, like I said, a player that you want, or you're gonna be open a lot and <laughs> everything. Uh, I think I'll probably be able to get some of this over the next couple of months. Uh, keep trying to get some. You know, it was pretty pretty easy to get soccer, but soccer is fairly easy to get anyway uh, when it comes out. But I'm going to try to get some more of this. Uh, I do have some more that I'll do for another video. But, I mean, we're going to keep up with it. Um, trying to find some mosaic. Trying to find some mosaic hangers. Like, it seems like a lot of people have been getting some of um, those Genesis, and we didn't get anything. We got some good cards out of it, but we didn't get the Genesis, which I hope to get. Uh, got some more holiday we're going to come up with. Uh, got some top series one we're going to look at. Uh, we got a lot. We got some stuff coming up. Hopefully, we got some good pulls coming up. Anyway, see you down the road.